What's up guys, in today's video I'm gonna be showing you how to remove a forgotten pattern from Rocket Phone. So I got this phone right now, as you can see, I don't know the pattern. That's why I'm making this video to show you the whole process how to do it. But I have to mention a few things first. The first one, you need to know your Google account, the one you have on your phone right now, and the password. If you don't know the information, you wanna be able to unlock your phone because you are gonna remove the pattern, that's fine. But on the way to set up your phone again, you will have to sign in with your Google account for you to be able to set up your phone all the way. If you don't know that, not even try it, guys. And another thing, everything that is now in your Google account, you will lose it. Like basically, all the pictures, contacts, and videos that are not on your Google account, if you never made a backup on your Google account, you will lose everything. So unfortunately, and this is the only way to do uh, this kind of process. By resetting the whole phone, that's the only way to remove the pattern, okay? So let's start with it. All right, guys, the first thing you're gonna do, let's go ahead and turn off your phone. Just press the power button and turn it off. Once your phone is completely off, what you're gonna do now, you're gonna press and hold down the power button and volume up at the same time for 15 seconds. One more time, you're gonna press and hold down the power button and volume up at the same time for 15 seconds. But you're gonna do it this way. So you first of all gonna press the power button, then press the volume up, okay? Just like that. Power button, volume up. I will let you know when you have to release these buttons. Just keep holding down both buttons and I will let you know when you have to release them. Once you see this little menu on your phone screen, then you have to release both buttons really fast. Then I don't know why this menu is so small. So on some phones you will see it like that. On some phones it will be bigger. But in this case, guys, what you're going to do, you're going to make sure to select recovery using volume up. So as you can see, using the volume up, you can navigate on this menu. So just make sure you select recovery. And once you select recovery, just hit the volume down one time. Just like that. And as you can see, now we have the recovery page. This is the menu that we're going to use to erase the whole phone. So what you're going to do now, using volume down, you're going to go down until you see white data factory reset. Once you select that menu, that setting, you're going to press one time the power button. Let's do it. Then right here, you will see another menu. Using the volume down, you're going to go down where it says factory data reset. And then just press one time the power button. Right on the bottom, you will see this menu, wiping data. So it will take a few seconds, guys. So it will be fast. Now, after your phone finish, what you're going to do, you're going to press one time the power button. Make sure you have select on your screen, reboot system now, then press the power button. And as you can see, you see the volume down, you can just navigate on this menu. Just make sure it's right here. Reboot system now. You will know that this process is done when your phone take you to this menu. Automatically will be select reboot system now. So let me just press the power button. Your phone is going to turn off and it will turn it back on automatically. You don't have to press any buttons. Now it's time for you to set up your phone all the way to be able to use it. Remember, on this process, setting up your phone, you will have to sign in with your Google account and the password. If you don't know that information, your phone will be lagged by Google. So it'll be worse, basically. That's why I mentioned in the beginning that you need to make sure you know your information before start this process. You see now the phone is the way it came when it was brand new. So now what you have to do, just hit start and just keep going until you set up your phone all the way. This video helped you out. Please let me know in the comment section. Drop a like and don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video.